Hi there, this is Rahul from Educast Teams. Today I'm going to show you how to create a portfolio section like this in our theme. First of all, go to your dashboard. Now you need to go to this portfolio section. I have some portfolio I have already made. I'm going to show you how to make a new portfolio. Click add new. Just give in a title. I'm just gonna copy some content from here. I'm just gonna copy this and paste this in the content. And you need to add a future image. I'm just gonna add this image and set it. I'm just gonna publish it. Let's check in the demo there are two categories I'm going to show you how to create a category go back to the portfolio in here there is the add new portfolio category I'm just going to add two you can see I have already made a one category just click add new category and I'm going to post this portfolio in a category 2 section just gonna update it after that's done you need to go to your customize go to this home page section this portfolio section you just need to enable it after enabling it your portfolio should show in your home page let's check ok you can see all your four portfolio is showing here you can give some description here I'm just gonna copy some small content and paste it here and I'm gonna see, change this to view all let's just save it and check how our portfolio section is showing let's refresh our page let's check you can see the view all button and for portfolio I added one portfolio in this section two category and other two in this category let's check some setting in our portfolio section you can have only 50 characters to show only 50 characters will be shown here you can also give some background in this portfolio section I don't want any background you can also give some image as a background in this portfolio section let's check by giving a background and choose image you can see this background is showing in your section you can make a background scroll or just fixed this is now save it this is all the setting in the portfolio section now I'm going to show you how to create this call to action section go to this call to action section you just need to enable it you can give a title Wimp Pro we can give a description here and I want to change button to demo and you can give your demo link here you can also choose some background color or you can also choose some image to show let's check and give some image here I'm going to choose this image you can check your image showing here this is how you create and call to action button be sure to subscribe to our youtube channel and thanks for watching this video thank you